Good afternoon. Albuquerque's police chief says this crime is a strange one. A woman is charged with stealing thousands of dollars worth of potted plants from Albuquerque grocery stores. Police say she even used her boyfriend and her daughter to commit these crimes dating back to April of last year. News 13's Natalie Wattis joins us live outside one of the Albertsons that was victimized. Natalie. 36-year-old Lovely Degeer and 41-year-old Jason Morales were arrested yesterday by APD and the Attorney General's office. Now, over the span of a year and a half, Degeer targeted about five different Albertsons here in Northeast Albuquerque and was able to make off with around $8,000 worth of potted plants. The investigation into Lovely Degeer began in April of 2021. After multiple Albertson stores around Northeast Albuquerque began getting burglarized, usually losing hundreds of dollars worth of plants each time. So uh, I have seen my my variety of uh, strange cases over the year, and this one's going to be up there in the top tier of them. Surveillance video catching this white Nissan Sentra pulling up with plates later identified as stolen and Degeer getting out to steal any potted plants lined up on the sidewalk she could get her hands on. She hit up five different Albertsons locations in the area about 20 times. Ten times she was alone. Five times accompanied by her boyfriend, later identified as Jason Morales, and nine times accompanied by her 15-year-old daughter. This is a trend we sometimes see as people put their kids in harm's way as they commit crime. They're teaching their kids something that's gonna be detrimental to them for the rest of their life. I mean, you, you know, a lot of studies out there show that at a very young age, you form your personality. And and it's, it's disheartening to see that uh, parents uh, would put their children in these types of situations. The police report shows the crimes are seasonal, many being committed in April and September and March and May as plants were set outside. The report stating that as Degeer's criminal escapades continued, she became quicker. In one case, able to shove plants into her car and speed off in under 20 seconds. But what were Degeer, her daughter, and Morales doing with all of these plants? Selling them under the fake name Ana Trujillo on Facebook Marketplace. The original price tag stickers still on. The disappointing part to remember is a lot of times people are buying this property as a brand new property like, oh, I'm getting a great deal on this. And I think those individuals need to remember that they're feeding into the problem. Upon their arrest, Degeer and Morales had two guns, more than $3,000 in cash, $1,500 in stolen property, and drug-related items. Now, Morales was on probation at the time of his arrest. That's been revoked, and he's been charged with being a felon in possession of a firearm. Degeer herself is, chasing, or is facing 43 different counts, including shoplifting and contributing to the delinquency of a minor. The chief of police would not tell me at this time what charges, if any, her 15-year-old daughter is facing. Back to you. All right, Natalie, thank you. Now, because of the persistence of the shoplifting attacks, the Albertson stores were forced to change their displays at the time to try to save some of their potted plants. But when corporate told them to put them back up, the thefts started again.